Ladies and gentlemen, I am here today to provide you with an interesting perspective, okay? Now, interestingly enough, a lot of the perspective that it is that I provide is to uphold to the consistency of maybe the more complex topics it is I discuss. So, for example, a lot of the things that it is that I speak about are things that people may not know entirely the way I see it or can paint it the way I see it or maybe I don't see it in a certain way and I bring up certain things but the interesting thing is, is it's all relatable because it's all the same game that we play the game of life and before I provide this interesting perspective I want to put out uh, a small uh, I guess piece right and that's this most individuals in life believe that they have to grasp these extremely, you know, foreign concepts, whatever they constitute as an, you know, a difficult or maybe an extreme concept to them. They believe that's when the true progress is made. And don't get me wrong, those things are absolutely wonderful to obtain. And when you obtain them, you knew that you worked to a position where you've understood many things before. But the thing that people don't understand or some people don't understand is this. Those basic concepts, especially the ones that it is that I consistently preach, I you hear me sometimes say the same things in you know different videos, and that's because it all connects somehow, and I want to paint the best picture it is that I can because it's those basics, those fundamentals that support the very, I guess if you want to put it as a uh, visual representation, the pyramid that is the knowledge that you can possess, you know what I'm saying? People, in short, people like to skip over the basics and try to shoot for the stars when you have to work up there somehow. And that's realistically what it is that I'm trying to do with this channel. So let me provide this perspective for you. Life as a human being on this planet is understanding. So if we put that into a visual perspective, we can say what an individual possesses is definite, right? For example, what it is they're just capable of as an individual, how they see the world, how they treat others, you know, their skill set, you know, just everything that composes them as an individual. Let's say that's definite. They haven't interacted with anybody yet. Say them on their own is this ball, right? This ball of energy, quote unquote energy, so to speak, in terms of what they know in this life how their brain performs, you know, just all these things, right? The energy they give off now, now that's what we're going to talk about. Let's say somebody's a good human being, right? But aggressive by nature. For example, me, sometimes. For sure, I can definitely come off to some individuals as an aggressive person because I'm very passionate of what I speak about. So when I speak about it, not only do I speak a lot about it, but you see me moving, you see me my words changing, you know what I'm saying? And sometimes that fast bombardment for somebody that's, you know, maybe not as quick to keep up may at times interpret that as aggressive behavior. But, you know, people that I'm, you know, obviously interacting with are individuals that it is that I'd like to hold a conversation with. So they certainly understand it and recognize it for what it's for and don't misinterpret it, quote unquote. And when I mean misinterpret it, I mean in terms of my delivery and then their interpretation, what I'm trying to give off. Now, of course, any message that it is that I try to give off isn't going to give off 100%, but obviously my bridge or our bridge, rather, between you and me in terms of, you know, just human thought is something that's always fascinated me, so I've always tried to build that bridge the best I can and paint the best picture it is that I can. But some people may just focus and recognize and mirror the aggression through their own ignorance. Those reactions are a result of that, if I intended that or not. See, in life, you do not if you do not rather practice consistently viewing your actions and growing, many more things won't and will not make sense. So let me ask you a question, right? Is there any one human that knows everything there is to possibly know? Sit on that just for a second, right? Think about what you know, what you know you don't know, and now this one you can't think about. <laughs> you can only like begin to imagine. But think about everything that you don't know that you don't know. It's absolutely insane. And it's an interesting thing, the reactions and the interactions between all of us. See, the interesting thing, if you want to begin to understand it, is if you want to break it down into a visual representation, I feel like visuals are incredible, especially with these psychological principles it is that we possess and how we interact all the time. I feel like that's something that doesn't go unnoticed. And, of course, psychology is definitely this very interesting force. It definitely describes many things and it begins to paint a very important picture on the most interesting dynamic it is that we possess as human beings and that's 
this brain that it is that we have. So on this earth, that's that interesting dynamic. And for me, what it is I want to do is, is I sort of try to hone the skill of observing, but not just observing and not just painting a word picture. I would like to put it into different perspectives for other people to realize because you got to remember something. There was a certain point where I didn't know this. I would like to share this with somebody who would also like to know this. If you're here on my account listening to the things I listen to, I'd like to share that for you. So that interesting perspective, just the visual, right? Just think of the world and all of the different people on it and just try to begin to imagine how many different people think so differently in all the different places that there are. Remember, you know things, you know that you don't know things, and then you don't know a lot. And keeping that in mind, sure, you're not going to find everything out, and that's an amazing thing. Who the hell would want to do that? So, with that being said, if you keep those core principles in mind to always focus and train the basics, to always know that there are so many things that you don't know, to try to practice putting things into a visual representation in order to further your understanding because it's not as simplistically as it magically falling onto your lap. There's a certain way that you specifically can learn these things and maybe the things that I say may help you out incredibly or maybe they provide you with another interesting perspective for you to move forward onto another thing and see that's another interesting concept. Everything is this sort of web. We're all starting off at different points, so to speak, in some areas. Everybody also starts off at square one, so but that's a different topic. Everybody travels down different paths of life, but it's so interesting how all of this information connects on this web and how we can meet each other along the way and how certain ideas can spark certain other ideas through other people. Maybe you didn't learn it from this person, but this other person delivered it in such a way depending upon who it was they were. And now I know I'm speaking fast, but if you want the brief synopsis of what this is or you have to listen to it over again, I'm going to give you the summary, okay? Life is understanding. If you can look at it, And whatever way it is, because you're exploring your mind, to successfully interpret that information, to acquire the fundamentals, to further your understanding, so that way you can operate a lot more successfully through this plane, that's what I'm trying to promote and to, you know, hopefully provoke into your mind. Ladies and gentlemen, this is uh, the end of this video. I'm definitely going to be releasing a lot more, you know, of these types of videos as well as a lot of other interesting things that it is that I want to release like I said uh, in my uh, <laughs> this sounds so stupid but my walk and talk last night if that's what you want to call it I uh, I realize a lot more what it is that I need to do more than I ever have in my entire life and I truly do believe as long as I don't die or get hit by a bus and become you know mentally crippled I really do believe that I am on to something great for me. Great for me, and yes, great for others, but definitely great for me. It has to stay true to me. And that's what I said in that last uh, description of my video. See, a lot of individuals and a lot of creators, they... And not necessarily, you know, let's limit it to individuals such as myself who like to explore life and post that type of content. But let's just say, like, something as simplistic as vloggers, right? It seems as if they just want to mirror what society, you know, wants, the vast majority. And for me, it uh, it goes back to that natural and uh, artificial thing. For me, regardless of if there are going to be many people that are going to want to hear this type of intellectual content, you know, not millions, trillions of views, I need to stay true to who it is I am. Now, although I do enjoy being a goofy bastard, and of course I'll make those videos from time to time, that's who I am at heart, and I have to, you know, be who it is I am at heart, but recently I realized more and more of what it is I need to do to stay true to me, because if I'm not staying true to me from the core... Anything that I give you guys is crap, so I have to have to make sure that I'm doing the right things for me, because I need it to come from a genuine place. That's not to say I don't care less about other people or to come off anything like that. 
I need to make sure I'm in check first so the product that it is that I provide for you guys is better. And now more than ever, and I've done this content since I'm 19, it's March 12th, 2018, five more months, I'm going to be 22. I am extremely, extremely satisfied, more than satisfied than the progress that it is that I've made. And especially last night with all of the work that it is that I did, I've had a profound discovery and just know that the content that is to come is going to be incredible. Thank you guys very much for watching and <laughs> stay tuned.